Hi, it's Deb Rayley with Monday Marketing Tips. Okay, so today I want to talk about when we go to a restaurant. Uh, most people go out to eat at least once a week and oftentimes we will pay with a credit card or uh, and, and write the tip in or leave the cash tip. So I want to share with you just a little different way that you might leave your tip for your server or engage with your hostess because I want you to th keep in mind People who work in a restaurant industry as a server or as a hostess, they are generally not well paid. They generally work for tips, so that's a little inconsistent or a lot inconsistent. Um, they either work really long shifts or they have multiple jobs or they don't work enough to make ends meet and they are trying to figure out how to work harder instead of necessarily working smarter. So if you have a business that has blessed you and has, has served you in some way, here's a way that you can just share that blessing with someone else so that they are not constantly spinning their wheels too, trying to figure it out. So at the end of your meal, you've received your bill, you've, you've put your credit card there. I put your tip, put the tip in a cellophane bag. So I've got my $5 tip here in my business card. Now let me show you what else I've got in this bag that I'm handing to that server. I have a postcard, right, that I've printed up, and it simply says, thank you for providing great service. As an independent business owner, I've grown to appreciate and recognize great customer service. So thank you for making my experience today wonderful. I'm in the service business and I would love to share with you a little bit about my business because you would be great doing what I do. My contact information is below with additional information inside. I would love to hear from you. Okay, and then inside this little bag right here, I've included a mini catalog right there and a snapshot, a little card that I printed up with a snapshot, right, of my last 10 um, shows. So it's got my profit there and how much I gave away for free and all of that information, just to give them an idea. And so I don't just leave it on the table. I actually do uh, talk to the person and say, hey, you know, I want to tell you, you've provided some great service today and thank you very much. I really appreciate it. I have something here I'd like to share with you uh, along with, of course, a tip. Um, and in return, I would love to follow up with you after you've had a chance to look through everything and see what you think because I think you would be great doing what I do. We could always use people in our, in our line of work that provide great service. So if, if, would it be okay if I followed up with you and then ask for her to write down her contact information? It could be a phone or an email address, however she's um, easiest to get in touch with. So I want to encourage you to stack your bag or your purse with a couple of things like this so that the next time you're out at the restaurant, I want to encourage you to give it a try um, because you really could be a blessing to someone else that's just trying to figure it all out. Okay, so give it a try, see what happens, and no matter what, stay fabulous. Take care.